And we welcome back to the to the bridge today. And the mascots for today are the Sherling and the Eleven Black. Saturday's game saw the clash between Sherling and Melksham Town as they both looked to gain a vital three points to edge closer to the playoff places. But it was the boatman with the first clear opportunity of the game testing the opposition after a poor back pass by Melksham's number four. Late in the half, the pressure mounted for Melksham Town with set pieces causing an issue affected by the conditions. Eventually, the boatman broke the deadlock with a free kick sailing through the Melksham defence with help from the six yard box bouncing over the opposition keeper, with Ryan Cluett scoring his first league free kick of the season. The second half started as the first ended with a goal in the 46th minute from top scorer Daniel Mason taking him up to 14 goals in all competitions for the season. Chances were being created by the home side, with the usually composed Bradley Target failing to find the back of the net which would have taken him to a milestone 10 goals this season. Despite the missed opportunity, Target's link-up play on the left-hand side led to a very well executed move by Scholing, who added to the scoreboard, making it three on the day, finished by number seven, Stuart Green. The lead was quickly extended, with a pullback falling to skipper Byron Mason, who shot underneath the glaring sun, trickled in off the post, adding to the milks and misery. A great afternoon for the side in red and white, capped off in the last minutes of the game, with a square pass to Connor Whitley, who found the net after a deflection from the opposition defender. Full time, Sholing 5, Melksham Town 0. The first half we were... You know, trying out a new formation, um, it didn't really work for us, so we went back to what we know and what we're good at, and um, I think everybody saw that the end result was worth well, you know, change of formation to, to achieve that. So yeah, I was really pleased second half. Clean sheets, that's what we're always about. Uh, nine times out of ten, we win matches or sort of, you know, one nil, two nils. Uh, I think we've had 18 clean sheets so far, so I'm really pleased with that today. Saturday's win saw the Boatmen reaching 3,000 points in the club's history since their first league campaign back in 1961-62 season, also ending a run of four games without a win, running back to the 25th of January. Next up they face Slimbridge side, who sit 10th in the league, a tough game for both sides with goals expected. Taylor Sinclair, Winchester News Online.